Well, it was the music that made the difference for me, and that's why I was able to stay there. And, and I did, you know, sense this uh, hidden world. And uh, I didn't go into the forest. They didn't actually take me with them into the forest for, you know, quite a while. Uh, and then uh, when I finally went and lived in the forest, then it was uh, really fantastic. And then the hidden world was revealed to me. Yeah, well, I mean, I've always liked forests, so I was very happy to go into the rainforest. I n always knew I would love the rainforest ever since I was a child, you know. I love insects, reptiles, snakes, you know, trees, plants of all kinds, and I love music. And uh, this had the best of both worlds. It was a tropical forest, and, you know, I'd read a lot of uh, jungle books when I was little, you know, books about the rainforest, Colonel Fawcett ex explorations, and... Uh, Conan Doyle's Lost World and um, just a whole bunch of books like that. A lot of stuff on the Amazon and uh, not so much on Africa, but the Colin Turnbull book. And uh, I always knew I'd like the, the rainforest. So that, that wasn't a problem, and I did. I liked it even more than I thought I would And uh, with the music. So going into this forest, it was fantastic. And, uh, and then the music, there were lots of surprises. Well, I mean, it's really hard to generalize about anybody, but, you know, um, but I, I guess what I said in the book is that they had a great sense of humor and they were, um, they don't, they don't hold resentments. They, uh, they're tuned to the moment. They don't think so much about far into the future or deep into the past. You know, they, they, they like to live in the present. And uh, I've learned a lot from that. And I mean, that's, I, I feel when you start m living in the present, it's like you've woken up. It's like before you were in a kind of trance. <laughs>